Well, we have a follow up to a story we first told you about on Monday that's gotten a lot of attention. A car driving in the pedestrian lane of the Ravenel Bridge caught on camera. Yeah, News 2's Jordan Sayopo went to that pedestrian path today and has more from local police. Well, it's not every day you see a car driving in the pedestrian lane on the Ravenel Bridge. Well, that did happen on Monday, and now the Charleston Police Department is working to make sure this never happens again. Cell phone video captured this week has left many wondering why a car was in the pedestrian lane on the Ravenel Bridge. I'm just trying to, in my mind, understand how in the world one driver could end up on the bridge and also how they were able to maneuver so far along on the bridge. Ben Buckles was finishing up his daily walk on the bridge when he says he saw police cars rush up East Bay Street Monday afternoon. To my surprise, later that afternoon, I kept come to find out there was actually a car that had made its way onto the pedestrian walkway and I was just shocked by that. I, I could not imagine what the people on the bridge were experiencing seeing that happen. According to the Charleston Police Department, an elderly couple from out of town was traveling on East Bay when they unintentionally entered the walkway. Once police located the vehicle, the next step was safely getting it off the bridge. As you can imagine, up there is pretty tight, um, especially for a vehicle. So they were able to navigate around the diamonds and um, backing out was not an option. Sergeant Anthony Gibson said as police are meeting with the Department of Transportation and the city's traffic and transportation team to explore possible changes at the pedestrian path. With any modifications that we're going to recommend, it's going to be to allow the free flow of pedestrian and bicycle traffic while restricting vehicular traffic from getting up there again. Though it's not something you see every day, Charleston police want to prevent a repeat. We understand that there is um, a comic, uh, sort of a, a comedy around it. However, that's a very serious situation. Um, and that's where we're starting to step in and look at things differently. Police say the driver was issued a citation and no one was hurt. Reporting in Charleston, I'm Jordan Sayopa, Count on Two.